little demonstration on how to create a navigation controller in Xcode and navigate from one screen to another by simply clicking on a button. There's not very many steps involved, so let's get started. So we'll create a single view app as here, and we go next. And on this screen here, I'll give it a title, so navigation. And notice here, that for this particular uh, exercise, we'll choose Storyboard rather than Swift UI because I want to show you how it's done in Storyboard. So we click Next. And we'll save it to the desktop. And we'll give ourselves a little bit more room. So in order to do this, we're going to do all our work in Storyboard. So we go to Storyboard. And we have a simple view controller in the screen here. So the first thing I'm going to do with that view controller is embed that in what's called a navigation controller. So we'll select it, go down to here, and say embed in navigation controller. The alternative way to do the same task as I'm just about to do is to go up to the menu here, where you go editor, embed in navigation controller. So there's two ways of doing that. So let's do that. So now you'll notice that we've got a navigation controller to the left, and our view controller here on the right hand side. So let's give this view controller a title at the top here. So I'll give it the title of Home. And you'll see Home appear there. Now the next thing you want to do is bring in another view controller to navigate to. That's just the controller. That doesn't do anything but control what's going on. So you don't see that on the screen at all. You see this as your initial view controller that you see when you first start the application. So what I might do is I'll just add another view controller into this, this scene. So I'll click on the asset up here and type in view controller. And there we go. Grab that and put that beside this one here. Maybe shrink that everything down. Not quite that much. Now, in order to navigate from this view controller to the next one, I'm going to create a button on this screen here and then connect it to that view controller. So we'll do that. So we'll get a button and we'll type in button. Grab that and put that in the screen here. And I'll give it a bit of a um, description. We'll put second view controller. The typing is not amazing, but that's okay. It's not about that. Now to connect that button action to open up that new controller, we simply hold the control key on the keyboard, click on the button and drag it to that view controller. You'll see it makes a little connecting line and select show. You'll notice one thing happens straight away is we now have a navigation button here on this view controller, which allows us to go back. So when we click that button, it goes to this view controller. When we click that button, it comes back to here. So what I'll do is I'll give this a name too so that you know exactly where you are. So I'll put that title. Okay. Okay. Now we're done. Now we can build the app and run it. So I'll select iPhone. 11, that'll do, and run the app. And by clicking on this button here, we can go to the second view controller. So you click the button, and there you are. And then to go back to the previous one, click home to go back to home. That's it in a nutshell. It's as simple as that.